All right, let's go. Begin the attack. Oh, los, los. I mean, Banzai, Hideo, Kojima, roll. All right, wait for that 40 millimeter to start firing off. All right, here they go. The attack has begun. We'll have to watch that left flank a little bit. I think some of our tanks might get too close to it. Look at this. Holy shit. Look at all those guns. All right, start taking them out. Take out that AT first. Oh, man, they're wrecking our infantry. Hello again, friends and fans. Raptor here, and welcome to Wake Island 1941 here in Metal War Assault Squad. Japanese are poised to strike against the American defenders, and we are ready to rock. We've got mortars, tanks, AT, infantry, marines, and everything else, and in between. We've even got trucks that are loaded up with 20 millimeters, and mortars popped right there on the back, so that's going to be awesome. Make sure you pop that like button as well. Show your support, too. Let's get 550 likes on this one for the hardworking mod makers as well, and if you want to download this mod, check the description, of course, and and look for where Raptor told them that you sent them. So, anyway, go ahead and uh, subscribe to that. And also subscribe to me if you want, too. Thank you very much for your support. And give a Circle 7. And let me know down below in the comments section if you're a former, current uh, military serviceman for any nation. Or you have family that was in the military at any time. Go ahead and let me know their history down below. What did they do? Tank men? Did they, were they regular infantry? Machine gunner? I don't know. You tell me. So, anyway, looks like, uh, wow, these uh, U.S. Marines here are looking mighty fine and uh, they're going to be in defensive positions against our Japanese forces that are advancing here today so I'm gonna need all the support I can get we've got several Japanese infantry squads and some tanks as well that are going to be very useful here we've also seen that the enemy does have a 20 millimeter uh, mark 10 there so that's going to be very deadly against our tanks so we're gonna try to mortar the hell out of that position first and then get started with the battle so let's see if we can get rid of that gun we're gonna have this uh, mortar move up right away then and try to do this as tactically as possible surgically tactical I guess with a random firing mortar Mortar, but we'll see if we can hit him. So here comes the first mortar strike. It'll probably be a miss. But the good thing is, is if he hits nearby, there is a chance that he'll hit some of these heavy concrete bunkers. And if those are destroyed, then that means the uh, machine guns and marines inside those are going down as well. Boom, 20 millimeters out. That's exactly what we were looking for. All right, infantry out of the way. Tanks are up now today. Get up on your feet, boys. Let's go. Get out of the way. Los, los. I mean, uh, whatever the hell it is in Japanese. All right, move up. Tanks are moving up then. Infantry is moving up. We're going to... Plow, uh, plow through the barbed wire, push it out of the way. These guys are just lazy. Hello, Japanese, stand up. Only one guy is being told to do that here. Wow, everybody's just lazy as hell today. All right, anyway, they want, will want to keep their heads down with all the uh, whirling machine gun fire that'll be up, a, up on over their heads in just a second. And yep, we see it right now. Japanese tanks pushing through, Japanese infantry coming in from behind, beautiful. Looks like uh, trench is already being taken out, mortars already firing off, infantry coming up through the gap. There we go. All right, off to a very good start here, and machine guns already opening up, so we gotta eliminate those as soon as possible. All right, Japanese on the left side then can advance as well. Mortar, hopefully it uh, continues to engage some of these uh, trench positions. Infantry coming up now. Let's go ahead and uh, Hideo Kojima Banzai, go boys! All right, excellent. So they're pushing through over here. Japanese are thundering through. That's wonderful. American reinforcements coming up. Looks like the Marines have heard some uh, commotion on the other side. And they're coming to help their brothers, but a little too late. Looks like all positions are pretty much open. There's still a machine gun up here, so we better get down. And uh, we'll continue to crawl up to some of those trenches. Uh, we're going to take losses regardless. We're on the attack, so that's the name of the game. Let's get a little closer with that mortar and see if we can hit some of those uh, defensive positions. And let's get up in there. Let's get into that trench, and we'll overwhelm them with grenades. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Just overwhelm them. Go, boys, go. Those guys will cover. Meanwhile, this is our assault force pushing through. Wonderful. All positions eliminated here. All right, that area is clear. Wow, that took like two seconds. Good to see that. Too bad we can't get on that 20 millimeter and capture that, but we can turn the machine guns against the Americans if needed. But we're on the attack, so I'm going to keep uh, keep here. But we do have an American Stewart coming up, a Stewart tank. Good thing we've got a tank destroyer to deal with that. Let's get our uh, Mimi Sohoni one up here. And uh, we'll jump into those uh, trenches as well with the Marine, or well, our, we've got our own Marines as well. I'm going to jump into these trenches with Japanese Marines as soon as possible. We want to keep the mortar truck alive too. That is ex an extremely expensive and very vi a vile weapon against the enemy. It's going to be uh, something that they're going to end up hating very much. All right, Stuart here on the other side of the tree. Can we kill it? Yes, we can. Let's kill it. 
Looks like we don't have, oh, a little, uh, little too low on the ground. Plus, the oh, he's hiding just behind the tree. Puny American tank. Doesn't know the power of the Emperor. All right, let's take a shot on him. Oh, he's shooting back. Oh, and it's on fire. Well, let's get him before he gets us. Shooting into the dirt. Another AT gun or something firing off. Those stewards are pesky. One of the worst things that you'll learn in Meta War Assault Squad 2, by the way, is the uh, ability of certain vehicles to fire at you while you can't fire back. Oh, that was a hand bomb there I was going to use against that tank. Let's give it another shot. So that AT, a good weapon, but not good enough. We'll use good old Japanese infantry then. Excellent. All right, very good. So we did save our regular tanks too, by the way. That can't go any further. Unfortunately, we've got some uh, good defensive positions in front of us, including AT guns and such. So we're not going to be able to get that far. But the Americans aren't going to go down with a fight, and that's good to see that they won't just roll over with that steward standing its ground. Beautiful. Trenches being hit there with grenades. And mortars are firing off too, and you can see the mines exploding around those trenches. We're, gonna, we're evicting them. You guys are out. Throw those grenades, boys. Come on, get those grenades up. There we go. Beautiful. Landing into the trenches now, cleaning out the rest of the American forces. Okay, very good. All right, the fight's only going to get harder from here, so now Japanese Marines are up. The more territory we capture, by the way, I believe, the more points we'll get to to call out additional weapons. So for those of you who wanted to see that AT gun do something other than explode, which with no armor at all, it's very good at doing, we'll see that very soon. So Japanese tanks are going to stay put. Japanese infantry is coming up, and the Marines are coming up as well to uh, clear out the further defensive positions back here. For instance, this 40 millimeter here, or that M3 AT gun, those are gonna have to go bye-bye. We could possibly repair that tank, but as we saw earlier, it was hull destroyed, not just damaged, so that's unfortunate. And we're gonna wanna be careful about our advance because there are mines around, and still, American infantry in those trenches. Let's clear them out, boys. Man, they're really persistent. Marines in Wake Island not giving up without a fight here. Okay, we're in good defensive positions. That 20 millimeter still still uh, opening up on us. We're going to have to hit that thing. Too bad we're just out of range of it. But plenty of Marines falling into the trap of our mortar. And we've also got a 20 millimeter standing by as well, which we could possibly park up here and hit. Oh, it looks like a wow, guy with a handgun. Man, Japanese infantrymen just getting knocked out of tanks left and right. Do we have full squads here? I don't know where this guy came from. Uh, I don't even know where you go over there. All right, I don't know. All right, 20 millimeter here, ready to engage. Let's see if we can flip that gun around the other way. There we go. Commander, capture the hill which leads to the airfields. Americans are dug in, so use mortars to clear hills and trenches. Oh, I didn't even know that, but yes, we did capture that, as we were told, so very good. I'm gonna try to come down here and see if we can hit them. Amer Americans have mined the approach to the airfield. Use sappers or see if you can find something to clear minefields. All right, well, we've got something very good we can use, which is just our mortar firing away at them. That 20 millimeters, or the 40 millimeter for the Americans still pissed off. We took uh, some good losses here at the trench, as you would expect. Uh, not too bad, though. Not not as horrible as you'd think. But this trench is going to be hard to hold for the time being as the Americans continue their counterattack. All right, we now have to use sappers to clear the uh, minefield, so let's go ahead and do that. And we did get uh, the reinforcements that we wanted. We did get the uh, added points that we can use. So let's continue with the mortar trucks. They're extremely valuable in this battlefield as the Americans are heavily dug in. So we want to use that to our advantage then. Who's this? Is this a sapper here? Mine disposal unit. There he is. They're starting to arrive. Let's continue to push up. We don't want to threaten the tanks at all. So we want to keep them in the back, but we'll put our uh, own infantrymen inside some of these concrete structures to hold back advancing Americans then. 20 millimeter over here doesn't seem to be within range of those weapons. So that's good, and they're going to continue to chew away at the infantry, but I want that to, ha uh, it's better than, you know, them shooting at our mortars, so that's a good situation there. Let's continue to push fighters up into that trench, though, to shoot back at the Americans. And our mortar will continue to mortar, as it does, as it would do. All right, yet another mortar truck coming up. That's good, I'm glad to see these. We're going to need another squad of infantry, I think, to make up for losses, and... We're out of mortar trucks as well. Marines are still standing by, but these are such a good fighting force that I don't want to use them until we absolutely are bogged down and need them to uh, change the tide of battle. There's an AT gun there and there. Once those are clear, we should have free range on the airfield. Um, we're basically right ready to capture the airfield. We still need to get up here with our sappers, though. Let's make sure we keep a good eye on these guys. Mine disposal. Mine disposal. Okay, these guys. Uh, let's see, are these regular infantry? All right, good. So these guys are coming up. So the mine disposal units basically can walk around, detect mines, and then that makes your tanks basically invincible to mines in the area in which they search. And uh, we still got to kill that 20 
or that 40 millimeter up there, so we got to get a good mortar shot on that position, I think. Uh, we're just out of range of it. We've got about 110 uh, meter range on that, and those AT guns are getting pretty close the closer we drive. So let's hide next to this tree. They'll never see us. <laughs> and uh, hit that uh, AT position. Then if we hit that AT position, we could flank that mortar, or that uh, 40 millimeter somehow. We can actually hit that from here, too. Let's hit that at, at the same time. Looks like we're out of, of range from them. I, I guess they don't see us, or they can't engage us due to the power of the Emperor. All right, let's go ahead and hit that AT gun, guys. Come on. All right, both t uh, trucks engaging that AT now. And if we can clear the way for the tanks, that'll be good. Hitting anything here is uh, just fine by me. If we hit a trench, a gun, or an AT gun. Come on, you guys. You've got to have better shots than that. You're holding up the whole advance. Wow. All right, well, hopefully we've got plenty of uh, ammunition. We do have... Oh, uh, that's the 20 millimeter. We do have about... Uh, a hundred and something rounds for our mortars, so that's good. We can always resupply them if needed. Got to hit that AT gun, though. Oh, beautiful. 40 millimeter down. We can actually capture that. Okay, that's one good situation. All right. And the second one coming up then, and we'll push forward with our infantry right now since we don't... Oh, actually, we need to push up with the sappers. Well, infantry's going to have to get close at least. There's a whole minefield in front of us, so let's get to the edge of the minefield. And then... Um, Let's get to the edge of the minefield, and then we'll try to yep, eliminate those trenches so that way the sappers can come up. Mortars are immediately taking action on that trench line, and we'll try to pin down the other guys. All right, Japanese sappers get up here. Some guys are swimming. Guys, come on. We haven't won the battle yet. Come on now. It's not time for vacation just yet. Okay, well, good news is, is once that AT gun is out of the way, we can bring up our tanks on the far right flank and capture some positions over here and quickly flank the Americans. There's a steward standing by there, so we'll get that uh, second half of the battle ready. Let's uh, make sure we don't advance too far. All right, good. All right, let's get all of our boys up and on that line. Japanese are still fighting through. That's close enough. Okay, and the sappers. Let's grab these guys. All right, Brian, we told you to come in. He's still out there swimming. That guy, every time, every battle. Get up here. Get back to the beach. All right, whatever. Get eaten by sharks, then. I don't care. All right, let's get the rest of our guys on the line. Let's get into this fight. So we need to clear the minefield. If we run out there, it's suicide. If we drive across it with our tanks, it's suicide. One way to clear a minefield, of course, is with mortars. But that's going to be bad news. And speaking of bad news, we got two bad news is coming towards us. Those Japanese tanks are going to have to stand against those stewards, then. Go ahead, boys, and load up with AP. No, 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 no. Just load AP. That's all you got to do. There you go. Oh, shit. Our boys are being counter-mortared, or are they walking into the mortars? Or, I mean, the uh, mines. Holy shit. Look like the edge of the minefield there. Oh, actually, they must be being mortared or something. 20 millimeter here. Destroyed, unfortunately. Hitting the uh, getting a hit by that tank. It's not good. Taking a, taking a hit, but so did they. Excellent. All right, let's get our sappers up here, finally. Some of our infantry walking right into it, but that's fine. All right, uh, riflemen, where are our sappers? Let's see, where did we put them? Oh, here they are, I think. Okay, mine disposal units. All right, good. You guys grab your, uh, how do you guys use my, how do you, I don't even, I never do this. I have no idea what to do. Okay, mine disposal one going up. Let's see, mine disposal two. All right, we're going to clear out both ways. Well, it's a shame some of our infantry couldn't read signs. They actually just walked right past it, but that's fine. Japanese infantry is a dime a, a, a ten dozen. So, uh, anyway, Japanese sappers are moving up now, looking for mines. And there's still a few infantrymen out there, but luckily we still have our mortars. That's really the most important thing here. So we lost our AT gun earlier. We lost our 20mm uh, earlier, but that's nothing compared to having tanks, infantry, and mortars. That's going to really change the tide of this battle. All right, look at all the mines we found. So it looks like the minefields are right here. Oh, my bad. All right, we're going to continue to look for these mines then. Oh, careful, goofball. All right, let's continue to look through. These are AT mines and such. So our infantry and tanks will be immune to these mines now. We can just drive over them with no problem. Let's continue to look and make sure we've captured the whole... Uh, whole minefield then. We want to make sure we don't miss anything and then we'll start our advance again. This gives us plenty of time to call up our infantry that's, uh, I guess, uh, lagging behind. But we do have uh, Brian here who's on infiltration mode. What the? Oh, and there's yet another. Oh, wow. He's at, wow, okay. Uh, good good work. Oh, several, several guys trying to go down that way. Okay, enough of that. Let's get started with our next attack. 
So we need to have mortars ready to strike up here. Let's get up in, into the game. And I think we've discovered all the mines that we could. Looks like these sappers did a pretty good job. And let's make sure we've cleared the way in front of the tanks too. And uh, we'll do that right now. And uh, let's make sure all mines are clear from this side. Okay, Americans are being pinned down. Let's let's move up to that next trench. We're going to clear this line here. Try to capture that AT gun and that 40 millimeter too, which are going to be super useful here against the defensive positions behind us. And so are the mortar trucks. And uh, unfortunately, we can't call out anymore. We don't have the time for it. So we do not want to lose these tanks. Please make sure you find these mines. I want I want to make sure every mine is found. It's holding up our advance just a bit. But that's okay. Ryan making a secret infiltration over here, trying to defeat the American army with just one man. I don't think that's going to work out. I told him to come back, but he's on his own now. Whatever. You do you do your thing. Okay. Meanwhile, two tanks ready to go up, and all we need to do is just keep killing American tanks as they come up to us. Nothing we really have to do, but we can capture enemy tanks, can't we? No, it looks like they're dead, too, so that's on. Fortunate. All right, let's have our infantry crawl through. We have a minefield in front of us, and we tried our best to find all the mines we could, but uh, it seems like we're just going to end up taking losses here uh, through the mines. So let's get our mine disposal guys all the way back. Mortars are firing again. Infantry start advancing then. All right, the minefield's done. I'm bringing those mine uh, detectors back to where they can be safe. All right, everybody advance. Let's get in there. Now again, some of our guys may explode due to mines. We may have not found them all, but we're doing our best. It's all good, all part of war. That's the way it is. But it looks like most of them are making it through, even with the uh, enemy infantry still firing at us. Okay, we've got the AT gun online. We've got the 40 millimeter online. Still some American infantry in there. Let's go in there and say hi to them. Hi, Marines. How's it going? Good to see you. Bye. Okay, great. All right, now our mortars uh, gonna have to cease fire there. Let's capture this 40 millimeter. Ooh, American mortars firing at us. Where the hell are those coming from? Ah, right here. No, not right there. Where are they coming from? I see them coming in from over here somewhere. Where did those damn mortars come from? Right here, maybe? Oh, they got a 40 millimeter here again. Well, anyway, first we're going to go east and take the remaining airfield. Then we'll start swinging to the north. So let's keep going through. Oh, I'm so excited to use those Japanese Marines as soon as we can, too. All right, rest of these guys are going to have to come up. These are our two sappers, mine disposal unit guys, standing by. And uh, is there a whole new thing of mines? I don't know. Let's continue to push up, though. Let's get all of our forces consolidated for yet another push. Mortars, please, please do not hit mines, please. All right, let's push through. Oh, somebody hit a mine. All right, push through. Okay, we're going to uh, grab those uh, AT guns as well. Let's uh, have our tank crew grab some of that. And uh, everybody else is going to push up. We're going to take this next position. Looks like American Marines there. Mortars, start doing what you do best. We're going to stay on the road then with our mortars. Nice, 40 millimeters opening up on it, mortars opening up on it. Let's get some uh, grenades into there. That'll surely clear them out. And an AT gun shooting in the back too. Look at that, American AT gun right there. So good thing we didn't advance with the tanks. I want to use them, but we have to be sparing with our use. All right, Japanese getting some nice grenades into the trench. Good grenade tosses. Come on guys, let's throw your grenades right now. Throw, 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 throw. Get them, get them, get them. Right, so if we get them to at least jump out of the trench, that's good Good news. They'll be uh, open to our infantry fire. All right, let's get a guy on the 30 cal. American 30 cal. Let's get that thing swung around. Good, now we can open up on that uh, trench line. Oh, and he's down already. I was going to say, let's get another guy in there, but he was dead. Okay, and let's get another guy in there, and we're good. All right, let's get all of our infantry into that trench. We need to open up on those guys, and they're not happy we're here, so that means we definitely need to fill that trench in if they're shooting back. Firing back with our own AT gun now. We're hitting that 20 millimeter. Beautiful, that was down. Good. There's yet another American AT gun there. Let's eliminate that. And let's bring up our mortars. Oh, is our mortar out here? Is he out of fuel? What's up? Wheel destroyed? He lost a wheel from a mine. Son of a bitch. Well, this uh, basically is a GG then. There's no way to repair that. So he's now a stationary... Uh, Stationary uh, unit. Damn it! Really? He must have hit an AP mine or something. That's a real shame. Well, good thing is, is we can grab all the mortar shells out of here and give it to the other vehicle. But nothing we can do about losing a wheel like that. Even though uh, they can repair flat tires, but they can't change a whole tire. That sucks. 
That's fine. Let's just get all the mines loaded up here. And we're good. Okay, perfect. Let's continue to use this truck. Okay? All right, we're going to push up with our American or uh, our enemies in front of us, Marines in front of us, and uh, we're going to start using our own Marines here in just a moment. We're going to need a, another large assault on this position, so let's get started. The first thing I want to do is find out where their AT is and eliminate that, then we can send in our Marines. We've still got a lot of forces spread out all over the battlefield. We did clear this way, though. Th this objective is complete. We, we punch through, and now we need to... Well, we punch through, and now we need to take the airfield. That's the next objective. So let's crawl up on these American trench lines. Oh, they're back on that 20 millimeter. Those sons of bitches. We're back down again. All right, guys off the 20 millimeter again. All right, Japanese infantry entering a fight now with the Americans. Let's have guys get on that MG. They don't like it, so we're going to have to keep doing it. All right, good. That'll keep them pinned down. Let's get our Japanese infantry close. And with them being a lot closer, we can also throw grenades. That's going to be a good thing. All right, we want some more infantry up here. We're going to need some more infantry reinforcements. Shame about the mortar truck, huh? Oh, well. That's war. It's strange how you lose a tire, but you know, can still fight. Uh, it's a weird thing. Too bad it's not in a good position, though, but that's all right. Oh, we got a flat tire here, but that's repairable, luckily. Mortar is doing a great job, though, of cleaning out enemy positions. AT gun there is down. AT gun here is down. They may still have more AT around. They do have a 40 millimeter up here that we're going to have to kill. So let's get the mortar in position for that. Looks like the mortar's already... Oh, he's been de decrewed, I guess. Let's get some guys on that. okay? All right, Marines are bailing out. This is good news. Let's get a guy in that mortar there. I don't know what they hit us with, but we need to watch out for uh, other 40 millimeters all around us. The flank is really where we need to watch as we advance. Okay, Japanese infantry Marines are up now. Let's see what they can do. We're going to have them push into some of those trenches. Looks like we uh, attracted a steward over here. Uh, get ready to kill that thing off. Make sure we can engage that vehicle. All right, our 37 millimeters engaging. Frack damaged on him. Good. He's crew injured. Good. And he's done. Very good. Okay, that vehicle's out of the game. It's just pretty much a couple of machine guns and 40 millimeters back there. Let's double time it now with our Japanese Marines. Clean out some of these trenches now. Name of the game is to get close. And yet again, our truck's been crewed. Let's grab whoever's nearby. This mortar is so much more important than anybody inside. I don't know where all of our Japanese Marines went. Well, we'll need some more infantry, so let's get them up here. All right, our truck's been uh, damaged a bit. We're going to repair that. Mortars can still fire off. And we've got our tanks standing by. Let's go ahead and advance with those now. Mine disposal unit standing by. Japanese Marines making their way up to that trench. And they've cleared out most of it. Very good. Not easy to attack this one. We don't have the mortar support at the moment. Alright, let's get in there. Shoot him, boys. All right, good. American Marines, still quite a few of them. They've uh, opened up the door on the right side then. That's where we needed it, so the rest of our Marines and Army can come in. Still that 40 millimeter there. Let's get on that mortar then. Mother mortar. And it looks like there's minefields on the beach, but the road is clear, so we'll have to just avoid the beach. Into the trench. All right, 40 millimeter, you're or, uh, you're gonna die from my mortar. How close do we gotta get to take that thing on? Right there. All right, we can engage that um, that position now. 40 millimeters, gotta die. 
All right, we're shooting at them now. That's good news. All right, the rest of our infantry is up here as well. How the hell? Okay, I guess our vehicle's on fire here. Bail out of that. They must have hit us in the flank. Actually, these vehicles aren't going to be as useful anymore. They're just going to be... Uh, Americans will take pot shots at them and basically kill them with uh, their 40 millimeters and such over here, which is what I assume they used. We're going to stay put back there until this area is clear. Mortar still up. And the 40 is down. Very good. Americans are pretty good at killing a lot of our troops there. On the flank like that. Alright, we're going to need more infantry. Man, all of our infantry seems to just keep getting stuck in the back like that. Let's get up here, guys. Alright, time for me to get all of our infantry organized. We're going to have to go in for a full push on this right side. Tanks are here, but we're going to use them later. Sappers standing by. Let's go ahead and get up by these transports. Okay, rest of the infantry is going in. Mortar's still firing off. 40 millimeter, I'm hoping, is down for good. Sorry about that, mortar. I meant to attack only the, uh, only charge our infantry into battle here. Come on, we need to land some hits on these French lines. We can't really advance until that's out of our way. Out of hell with it, let's bring in a tank. Alright, off the MG, we're going to need everybody we can get. Infantry still got to keep coming up. They're still getting caught in the back, so we'll bring up all of our reinforcements and make sure we're good for the next attack in just a moment. Alright, Marines and infantry, regular infantry, are going to be mixed together. We got to do what we got to do here to get a, a win. More Japanese infantry needed. Airfield's almost ours. Good defensive position there. We've taken that. Not going to be used by the Americans any longer. And now time for a Hideo Kojima Banzai. Three, four, five, six. All right, let's make sure that is taken down. All right, here comes the grenades. Boom, 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 boom. Good luck throwing all those. Beautiful. All right, Marines all but finished here. And let's get that last uh, defender in there. Oh, looks like there's still two. Let's just run in there. There we go. Okay, 40 millimeters ours as well. And all we got to do is take this last trench line here and the communication area around the um, airfield. And we've almost got it, guys. This is fantastic. Good job so far. Wow, some of our troops even out of ammunition. They've been fighting so long. Well, it doesn't matter. They're, they can still throw grenades and they're still cannon fodder to distract the enemy. Give them more to shoot at. All right, mortars doing a good job on this next trench. Let's just wait a little bit, let them finish them off. See that mortar shell screech by the screen? That was awesome. What do we have for mortars left? We've still got about something 40 rounds or so. Oh, come on now. All right, let's get this trench. I'm going to fire one more with mortar, and then we're going in with grenades. All right, that's all we're good for. Let's go. Okay, we've got enemy soldiers heads down. Grenades all going out like crazy. I'm tired of this. Beautiful. Let's get in right behind them then. Oh, now it's our defensive position. Oh, they're attacking us. They've overrun our position. Excellent. We've got it. Perfect. Oh, one soldier left. There we go. Okay, that's it. She's clear. That's our next objective completed, though it's not saying it quite quite frankly. Commander, we need to recapture the airfield. Be careful of counterattacks. Okay, we've got the airfield. We'll send a guy there and see what happens. B beautiful. We've done that. Now we just need to take this out. That might be part of the airfield defense, or this might be as well. I'm not sure. Oh, looks like we got it. Perfect. Okay, yet another wave of reinforcements at our disposal. We can call in a thousand points worth of infantry. Capture the barracks to stop reinforcements. Very good. All right, let's push all of our men up now. Make sure all of our reinforcements are up here for the next push. Oh, Americans coming in for a counterattack. A little jeep. Oh, and here comes the reinforcements too, all their infantry. Yep, jeep reinforcements coming in all over. Okay, Japanese Marines did a great job of helping to clear that side out. That was a pretty pretty good defensive positions. They had a, you know, a triangle defense around here, and then that, they also held the edge of the beach. So those Marines definitely helped to turn the tide against the other Marines. Very good. Okay, let's get into uh, our positions here and get ready to attack. We will push through this fuel center up to here where they've got a uh, good defensive position, but we can overrun it quite easily. 
We just need the infantry to do it. We just need to keep pushing our own infantry up. Alright, let's get our tanks up here. Let's continue to push in along the road. Okay, so the Japanese now hold the airfield, or at least some of it, so the Americans won't be calling in any more uh, reinforcements that way if they wanted to. If, if the battle lasted long enough, they can't use the airfield for reinforcements. They are calling up a uh, Stuart tank, though. Let's go ahead and take that tank out. Want to be careful with that 40 millimeter there. So let's not get any closer than this. And let's grab this American AT gun. Looks like he's going to be past our position, though. Flip that gun around. Beautiful turret damage on that one. And he's now hull damaged. Perfect. We can actually count. Okay. No. I was going to say we can capture it. Nope. Not going to happen. The Emperor didn't want it today. Good to see it blow up, though. All right. We are getting hit, though. So we better back up. Oh, boy. Stuart. Oh, he's hull damaged. He tracked us, though. All right. Ceasefire. And then ceasefire. Ceasefire. Come on, you guys. Ceasefire. Roof balls. Leave the thing alone. Okay, plenty of reinforcements standing by here. Let's get everybody out of these vehicles. Vehicles are worthless now. Let's just bail out. Everybody bail out. Uh, AT gun, that's worth something. Infantry, though, we want to attack from up here. So my plan now is to go up here to this side of the beach in the east and then come back down through here and clear everything out at this base. Then we'll do the same here. We'll try to punch in here, and then our final attack position will be here. And then uh, I'm, there's a little AA gun there that we can take, I guess, as a final attack. We'll uh, Hopefully, if our mortar's still alive, which it should be, then that'll be fine. All right, so it looks like the minefields. No more minefields. That's good. We can now use regular infantry. And uh, did Brian survive? No. Hold on a second. R.I.P. Brian. Just have a moment of silence. Okay, great. Let's continue the attack. We're going to... Uh, oh, looks like... Oh, may, maybe he... Maybe that's him there. I don't know. These guys really love to swim up that way, though. I don't know what that is. But we need some more infantry out. And this time, instead of calling out those infantry... Well, I don't know. We seemingly don't get enough Marines. They're, seem, they're, they're expensive. They're transport. Blah, blah, blah. I don't like them. I don't like them as much. Japanese Marines. I like the, I like the uh, regular infantry. You get a full squad, and you don't have to have them bail out. So let's use those. Okay. Plenty of Japanese infantry here, though. Look at that. All those reinforcements. When you consolidate all your forces, look at how much you've got. Holy crap. All right, we're going to push in, then. That 40 millimeter is still shooting at us. Let's take that out with the uh, with the mortar. And actually, let's see if we can just... Oh, wait. Get down, guys. I wanna... He's uh, insta-acking. He's doing some good snipe jobs. Oh, yeah. Ah, uh, okay. So this is why those 40 millimeters are so difficult to attack because you can't. Uh, they're, they're, they've got a 40 millimeter phaser up there, the fully automatic mounted sniper rifle, and our mortar's on fire too from that same bullshit thing. Look at it; it's just firing everywhere and it's just landing hits, even killing our damn mortar. That bastard! Let's see if we can get him before our vehicle's destroyed. Oh, and there she goes. All right, that's it for the mortar. So look at that thing; it's like Yosemite Sam is just shooting all our. <laughs> Mortar destroyed, infantry squad out. Yeah, those You're things right. are extremely deadly. They just get to do You're whatever right. they want. All right, let's keep calling out infantry. Then we'll call up 800 points worth of infantry then. So mortars are rip. Luckily, we won't need them as much. The defensive positions that we're facing are pretty easy now. They're, they're going to be ones that we can easily overwhelm. But first, we need to get our forces ready to rock. We could also hit them with tanks, but I'm not going to do that yet. I'm going to continue to build up our infantry forces. Our mortar here is still... Still poodered out, unfortunately. All right, forces are ready to strike. This is far from over. We're not in a bad position at all. Just a minor inconvenience. American infantry trying to retake the airfield. That's fine. I don't even want to mess with that 40 millimeter. Okay, let's take this position up here at the road, and we'll flank around with our tanks. And we'll take that barracks. That apparently will stop their reinforcements, so that's good news. It's going to be a machine gun there, I believe. Heavy machine gun. Vickers. Ooh, several Vickers positions. Oh, fuck. That 20 millimeter again. Damn that thing to hell. I hate that thing. All right, let's move in this way, then. We're going to move in on the beach. We're going to get this done ASAP. Let's get our tank ready to strike. Back with the uh, infantry again. We're going to build up our forces, then move them all out at once. All right, all we have to do here is take out this, uh, well, that 20 millimeter could still hit our tank, so first of all, let's just do this. Get a nice side shot on that AT. 
All right, beautiful. Infantry is doing a great job. They flanked him there. Wow, look at all of our forces there. Taking, taking hits. Oh, damn Stewart up again. Pulling up in a battle like the police. Boo, boop, boop. Sir, can you step out of the Japanese Empire? Okay. A good hit on that tank. Crew injured and hull damaged. Wonderful. Minimal losses there. Let's rush that MG. Fuck them. Come on, throw grenades, boys. That's yeah, usually what happens. One guy rolls up, the other one of them gets shot, and everybody else picks their nose while they're supposed to be throwing a grenade out. There we go, that MG finally down. Clearing the way for these guys. Plenty of infantry reinforcements coming, mind you, so losses at this point are not a, not a problem. Well, it looks like we're out of regular infantry reinforcements. All right, everybody else, come on up. Please, for the love of God, do not hit a mine. All right, we are calling out the Marines after all because they do have uh, some valuable troops in them. Let's just make sure all of our squads are moving up. So the top priority right now is to deal with any AT gun and 40 millimeter that we see. And we see one here and one there and one there and one there. So not too many of them left. They're going to be difficult to deal with though. All right, we've got all the Marines out now. Infantries move into their positions. Very good. Okay, we need to take out that 40 millimeter. So there's a little opening at the 40 millimeter right here. What I'm going to try to do here is try to use this fuel tank as cover. Yep, knew that was going to happen. 40 millimeter's not happy with us. But fuck them. Yeah, get wrecked, baby. They're going to try to hop back on that thing, but we're going to have to keep denying that. They're going to keep trying to reman it. It's a good position to capture if we can grab it. Okay, it seems to be down for the time being. Let's get all of our infantry up. And reinforcements have arrived. Fantastic. Japanese infantry arriving now. All part of the big attack. Everybody's storming out of the airfield now to capture that uh, barracks there. We've got Japanese uh, tank there being repaired. A Japanese tank over here repaired. Good. We can support the attack. All right. Let's get up on that 40 millimeter. Let's surround it. It's ours now. Get wrecked, baby. And yeah, they got their 20 millimeter shooting off. That's fine. They're gonna insta-ack all of our most of our troops. That's why we need that uh, 40 millimeter. Oh, yep. Look at that. Once our gun starts firing. Come on, just hit anything you can. There we go. There we go. So again, much easier to capture this gun than to go through all that mess. We just got to keep reinforcing it, that's all. That's what all that infantry was for. Back onto the gun. Oh man, what a weapon to capture. We're good. We got it. All right, tanks push forward, infantry push forward. So our attack come down from here kind of changed, didn't it? We're going to try to come in from behind, but now we've got all of our uh, vehicles pushing up. Oh, they got that AT gun back up again. Make sure that thing's down. Okay, good. All right, tank here has been damaged, but we can repair it and recruit it. It's fine. Wow, all of the uh, Japanese infantry here is impressive. Again, we'll get another wave of reinforcements from capturing this. Another wave of points to spend, but we're running out of uh, troops aside from Marines. Good uh, grenade. Wow, the amount of grenades there. Holy shit. Wow. Oh, damn, MG there causing some trouble. Just shoot, shoot it. There we go. Okay, the barracks are uh, one step away from being ours. We just need to find, uh, I guess, the commanding officer, wherever he is. There's got to be one soldier left here. Capture the barracks has been completed. All right, American tanks are ready to attack us. They're coming back. 40 millimeters standing by. Good. Damn, too bad we can't use that mortar tank, huh? That mortar truck would be a nice asset here. All right, Americans coming up with some tanks now. We still have our uh, Chihas standing by. 
Beautiful. One tank eliminated. Second tank is going to get wrecked by our uh, Japanese tank here. Let's make sure he's loaded up with AP, which he is. And let's just wait until they come through the buildings. They're probably just going to try to use this alleyway. Oh, no, he's going to come around this way. He's going to get a perfect uh, side shot on him. That's done. Beautiful. All right, the Americans all finished off here at the barracks. Let's start capturing their vehicles. And not too much of American uh, forces remaining on the island. This is good. All right, that tank's almost repaired. Do we have any other American tanks we can repair? Yep. We're going to start salvaging enemy equipment at this point and uh, see what we can do. Anybody else in the back is coming up. All right, we've got our Marines here standing by. Let's continue to call up any of the Marine forces we can. We'll use them as an absolute backup. And uh, where should we go now? Should we attack the left? I think we should attack here instead. Uh, but then again, that 40 millimeter is going to support that attack. Either way, we've got to get up there. They do have mines on the beach. Uh, we could get a tank up there very close. We're going to have to use some of our tanks now. Let's actually let's spend some more points on tanks. All right, we'll get our Marines up the road. And let's uh, put them up here for reserves. Very good. All right, and then we need um, all of these soldiers here to come on up. Get all of our tanks repaired. A little bit of a uh, wound linking right now. We've got to kind of repair everything that we've we've gone through. All right, let's get this done now. Japanese are repairing all the American tanks. Beautiful, good to see that. Japanese are repairing their own tank as well. 40 millimeter. A good weapon to have. Did you see all the uh, vehicles we killed with that thing? It was impressive. We lost probably two and a half squads to capturing it and keep keeping it. But as you can see, it destroyed two tanks and helped to def uh, destroy all the defenses here. No more American reinforcements from the barracks. They're all captured, now prisoners. POWs. You'll have to let me know what that means down below in the comments section if you're still watching, guys. Thanks for your support, too, by the way. I appreciate it to see people who make it to the end. Sometimes people just get distracted. And they're like, oh, fuck, a carrot. I got to go over there and sniff it. Okay. That's what they do, I tell you. I swear. Believe me. All right, time for our final assault to begin. We just need to uh, get the rest of our troops in gear here, get everybody linked up and tanks repaired. Shouldn't be too much longer. Now nah, that's a good sound. That means our tanks are starting to be repaired. This one here is up and fully operational again. Japanese infantry getting up into position. Tanks moving into position. Mortars, I guess, uh, going to mortar there. We do have a jeep, an enemy jeep that we can use. A good good weapon to have. Let's put one more soldier in that tank. We'll put a full Japanese crew in that tank. All right, look at all the soldiers we have ready. Not to mention our Marines who are now arriving. Let's get them for the attack. And let's see. Is this tank repairable? No. Unfortunately, it's not. And we're not going to go in with vehicles because uh, I think they're just going to get be hit by 20 millimeters and such. And these are Marines on these weapons as well. So... Uh, they're definitely good fighters. Paratroopers, what? Why would they have paratroopers? Huh. Well, marine paratroopers at least. Okay, let's go ahead and get started then. Get all of our forces together for a big attack. The marines will come in to clear everything out at the start and the end, I suppose. So we've got them standing by. Okay. Time to launch the attack then on our remaining positions. We've got a 40 millimeter and two AT guns here. And we've got a 40 millimeter and a 20 millimeter and two AT guns as well. So both pretty similar defensive positions for the Americans. Unfortunately, the beach being mined and uh, not a lot of cover between there and there. But I think one thing we want to do is overwhelm them with tanks. Why would we go to the trouble of capturing all these American tanks if we weren't going to use them? Well, a good question. Uh, and this is going to be the last of our reinforcements, by the way, aside from the rest of the derps straggling around. We're going to need every tank we can get to clear these Americans out, and we're going to need all the Marines, too. So we're going to have our big infantry attack from here on the roadway, and our tanks come out from behind the barracks. This is actually very interesting how we're preparing this. This is nice. I like this. Oh, well, you can just see all of our forces looming here. All right, let's get all of our tanks together. Japanese tank there repaired, American tank here and there repaired, jeep there standing by. Nice thing about a jeep is you can truly do it with one man. You can truly just uh, put one guy on the jeep and have it roll into position, stop, and start firing. 
Okay, anybody with a rifle is going into tanks. Let's start repairing anything else we can find as well. I want all of our SMG guys to remain. Oh boy. Beautiful. Alright, that is one tank on our side. Let's get another soldier in there. I guess four men in, in a tank is good. We got another tank repaired. So three Japanese tanks here standing by. American tank here has been repaired. This is good. I'm excited. Right, you guys just hop in there. Let's just get started. Okay. Let's uh, have the mortar truck abandoned. Abandon the mortar truck. We're going to need all these soldiers we can, we can muster here. The big attack is coming. This big attack brought to you by Joe's. Eat at Joe's for over 30 years, feeding the people. Eat at Joe's. Again, remember to check in. I'm just kidding. Promo code Joe's down below. All right, more vehicles being repaired. This is good news. Oh, that is a good sound. Everybody reporting that vehicles are repaired and fully operational. Let's start hopping in some of these tanks. We're going to overwhelm these enemy forces with friendly and enemy tanks. Let's get that tank turned around here. All right, we're going to try to get those four-man crews that we're looking for. All right. I kind of want to attack this position, but we can do both at the same time. We have three tanks over here and two tanks over there. Let's try to even out our forces then. Let's just get everybody in a tank. A couple more infantrymen coming up. Ooh, don't hit mines. Careful now. All right, this tank's fully operational. Okay. American tanks are going to the right. The Japanese tanks will stay on the left. I hear some mortars firing off already. That's not good. What do we have to capture? 20 millimeter here. Tank there we could possibly repair, but I think it's a little too close to enemy lines. Let's hop on this 20 millimeter and see if we can take some shots at them from here. Let's see what we can do. Whoa, what are you doing, goofball? Oh, it can't turn the whole way. Oh, that sucks. Is it because it's not repaired? Maybe it's damaged, so it can't turn. I'm not sure. Don't know. Haven't seen that weapon too often. All right, three tanks here on the right, ready to go. We've got an American fuel truck, too, that we could capture and drive in. It's like a suicide strike. That'd be interesting. It would never work, though. But one shot to the engine, it would come to a stop. All right. I think everything is finally ready for our big push. Infantry here on the right side will go to the right. Infantry on the left side will go to the left remaining marines let's get them up here what do we have for tanks left three japanese tanks on the left four american tanks on the right Ooh, we repaired something more vehicles being repaired where oh it was the uh that gun let's see if we can actually use it now i want to see if we can fire on it ah oh, damn looks like it only fire that way well we can grab the vickers All right, so what we'll do is we'll move this gun into position to uh, start keeping the heads of the trench down as soon as that attack starts. But for now, it's on the right side we're going to start the attack. So, without further ado, everyone, let us begin the battle for the north sector. All right, let's begin. Get all of our infantry up here and ready to strike. And once they're all in position, they're going out. Just grabbing them in random groups here. Don't care who. Whoever's got a gun, all you got to do is go forward. You see anything? That would piss the Emperor off. Shoot it. Kill it good. Okay, this should be good. Alright, infantry is going to go in first. Tanks are going to clear everything else out. Let's switch over to HE to make sure there's no boo-boos. HE, HE. Switching to the green shell now. The reason I want this is so I don't want them to switch ammunition types in the meantime. I want them to be able to fire HE right away and be more effective. Tanks are ready to strike. Look at that, man. Just capturing enemy equipment. Look at all the free vehicles we've gotten. All right, let's go. Begin the attack. Go, los, los. I mean, Banzai, Hideo, Kojima. Roll. All right, wait for that 40 millimeter to start firing off. All right, here they go. The attack has begun. We'll have to watch that left flank a little bit. I think some of our tanks might get too close to it. Look at this. Holy shit. Look at all those guns. All right, start taking them out. Take out that AT first. Man, they're wrecking our infantry. But we're wrecking them back with our tanks. One tank down. Alright, we got rid of that AT position on the right side. This 
is just the recon wave, by the way. Come on, guys, start attacking what's priority here. 40 millimeter, 20 millimeter. Second tank down. Third tank down. Let's get that 20 millimeter. Damn it, that's gonna be too hard to take. All right, all of our infantry's gotta come up next. So we've eliminated most of the anti-infantry weapons. We'll not be seeing too much in terms of reinforcements coming over from the other side, unfortunately. Wow, look at that, three tanks. So one trench cleared out, one, one and a half mini trenches cleared out. Now oh, they're calling over an AT weapon now. Let's make sure we get that willies. Keep an eye on that. That's the top priority right here. That weapon could kill us easily. Our, our turret's not busted, why are we not turning the turret? Is it actually All right, good. That weapon's been wounded. He keeps trying to prioritize the Jeep rather than the AT weapon in front of him. There we go. That's what we were supposed to do. All right, and they're trying to attack our positions. Good. They got reinforcements. A Lee coming up. That was the last thing that we needed. <clears throat> I thought this attack on the right side would be much more uh, rewarding. Unfortunately, we took a, quite a few losses with our... Uh, with our infantry, or our tanks, really. That's more important. All right, infantry has <clears throat> a defensive position here. There's also mines on the field. So let's make sure we've cleaned out these positions. we got to do it as fast as possible. They do have that 40 millimeter sniper rifle now. Every time it shoots, that's a death. Guaranteed. All right, let's take this trench. No time. Get up there. No time, get up there, get up there, go, 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 go. Don't shoot, go. Screw him, walk past him. Start killing him. Come on, shoot. Yeah, you can see the type of competence we're dealing with here. Let's get that machine gunner up there. 40 millimeters knocked out. Let's grab that 40 millimeter. All right, beautiful Lee gun down there. Beautiful shot on the Lee. Excellent, that's been eliminated. Tank down here, I infantry reinforcements still standing by. You can see most of our Japanese forces down, pretty much down to nothing now. We've got reinforcements here for the left side. Okay, it's almost done here. Let's get everyone else ready to attack that side. This one's uh, pretty much cleaned up now. We don't have enough gun depression here, I think. Can we fire HE? It's just, uh, okay. AP rounds. Very good. All right, this position almost eliminated. Let's bring in the rest of the reinforcements then. Seemingly we made it. That's good. All those American tanks destroyed two on our side. Amazing to see that. Let's get this one repaired and up and running again. Three Japanese tanks still standing by on the other side. I think we're going to attack from here. We have no choice because of all the uh, defenses not being over there. We can we can just filter all of our forces through here. So let's get everybody ready on a convoy to the other side of the island. All right. We got friendly marines coming in to uh, eliminate those remaining positions. Just a little cleanup here. That's all it's going to take now. Beautiful. We got a, a kill on that lead. That was really amazing. That was the last of their reserves, I'm thinking. Come on, guys, throw those grenades. Don't walk up to them and hand it to them. Come on now. Let's get it done, boys. All right, let's use this position here. It's just much easier to run into the trenches and shoot than it is to actually attack the trenches from the flanks. Okay, let's go. Let's get it done. Everybody else on the line. Beautiful. All right, our forces can pass through now up to this section and launch a final attack. Let's get it done, guys. All right, Wake Island about to fall. This has been quite exciting, I must say. All right, let's continue to bring up troops this way. Where's our infantry? I think some of them may have bailed out over here. 
All right, let's bring up the rest of our Marines. So we'll, we'll probably want some troops to flank from here if possible, so let's do that. This, uh, our MG got liquidated? That's a, that's a shame. All right, so we're going to have troops ready to strike from down here. And they will have 40 millimeters and ATs and such standing by. So we're not worried about that. Let's get it done. All right. So next course of action here. Oh, there's a 20 millimeter over there. Or 40 millimeter here. That's going to be really a pain in the ass to attack. What the hell? Something's hitting us. Ah, an AT gun right there on the roadway. Luckily, we were only turreted. Oh, he's hidden pretty well. Alright, we just need to shoot around this lead. Alright, let's hit that gun. Alright, we'll repair everybody else's healing up from the earlier attack. All of our remaining forces are being consolidated. Boy, this isn't easy. I thought it was easy. But uh, after that big botch, did, well, I guess I wouldn't consider a botch. They were definitely in some good defensive positions. We don't really have much of the enemy's vehicles we could repair other than abandoned vehicles of our own, transports and such. We have a steward that we're about to be on board with in just a moment. Maybe get out of the minefield. Oh, maybe get out of the minefield. Nah, minefields suck in this game. It's like peanut butter in your hair. Once, you're, once it's in, it's out. That's all right. Just a couple couple guys there. All right, that gun's eliminated. All we have to do is continue to attack them this way. Let's get that next gun then. All right, vehicles up. Hull damage probably from the 40. Yep. Just hide right here. Eliminate that. That's more important. Nope. Don't shoot at the uh, 40 millimeter. You have to babysit now. See, they try to prioritize the 40 millimeter, but they don't see the AT that can actually shoot them. They worry about the 40 millimeter that can't. There we go. Now we can worry about the 40 millimeter. All right, we're tracked. Bring in the steward. And our next tank as well. Crew up the steward. And we'll get this tank repaired. Lots of infantry in the trenches. Again, want to watch out for that 40mm uh, on that side. Our own 40mm doing a good job against enemy infantry. Is this tank eliminated? Ah, it's repairable. Alright, you repair. Everybody else is going up. I think the uh, Lee is out of the game as well, unfortunately. 40 millimeter down. This position's ours. Infantry's moving up. Let's go, boys. Excellent work. All it takes, man, is that accurate shot. Change the tide of battle. All right, that's trench number two or three clear. So they've got some more tr uh, trenches on the other side, so we can deal with those. Let's get the rest of our infantry up here now to flank them since we don't have too much of a threat anymore. And we'll get our jeep up here to uh, eliminate their positions. Then that final 40 millimeter. Alright, vehicles repaired there. Alright, let's have our infantry move up to this trench. We'll cover the other one. And we'll start trying to take shots at that 40 millimeter there. And let's see, also a tank here repaired. Good. Oh, he, oh they had a full crew. All right, they won't be able to fire at all of our tanks at once, so that 40 millimeter there is going to have to choose its target wisely. Well, so much for that. Again, our infantry, uh, our tanks prioritizing infantry in a trench rather than an uh, AT gun in front of them that they were told to attack. Uh, the frustrations of Men of War. No, no end. That's not good. He's got kind of a side shot on us. Again, trying to prioritize the infantry. And tank eliminated. So yeah, when you click on the tank and tell them to attack the 40 millimeter, they just ignore it. No, the infantry in the trench over there is so much more important. All right, let's get this position cleared. All right, everybody's running with a grenade. 
All right, that's it. That trench is clear. Beautiful. All right, let's do it again. Machine gunners standing by, keeping their heads down. Infantry going in for the kill. AT gun eliminated. Boy, I don't care at this point. I just want to have, I want to have some lunch now. Battle's been over. Americans just aren't surrendering. They're holding out to the last man for sure. All right. Final forces here need to be eliminated. And then we could have a 40 millimeter fight too. We can uh, actually arm up our 40 millimeter there. Let's grab that thing. French lines are being cleared out. Not too much remaining. Another grenade in there just in case they run in. Yep, they are. All right, that's it. All right, we're just gonna run in here and clean them out. That's it. Okay, anything and everybody. We're going to rush that 40 millimeter. Let's get it done. Anybody and everybody, here we go. Even the damn Jeep. I'm gonna call the Jeep, the tanks over, everything we've got. Nothing else on the map, so I, I would hope they would prioritize the uh, final position. Grenade the hell out of them, boys. Get them, get them wrecked. That's it. Whew, we did it. That's all over. Commander, we have captured Wake Island. However, some troops remain. A small island on the northwest captured the island for final victory, and I think we just did that as well. So there you go. Woo, we did it, baby. That is it. Well done. We've captured Wake Island, and our expansion will continue until the full of South Pacific is under the control of Imperial Japanese forces. All right, that's it, guys. Until next time. Password, Pimp Hand Strong. I'll see you. Bye.